Today we're going to unbox this Morningstar uh, inverter. This is just a 300 watts inverter. I have mine been running for five years, and I bought this. This is my second unit. So from Morningstar, designed in US and assembled in Taiwan. So it's a sure shine 300 watts sign with inverter so let's open this up this is a bit unique or in that sense very 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 versatile inverter among uh, other inverters in the market in the sense it's fully configure configurable so I'll show it to you how how versatile this one and how configurable this unit is. And let's discuss also the capability of this small but heavy literally heavy inverter okay oh yes so what it has is just a manual so very simple it also has the efficiency curves which is good ratings and it's all its technical specifications are inside so it has a reminder which is good very simple and yet very powerful and let's digest what's inside okay first things first this is just a 300 watt uh, inverter so this is good for emergency purposes like uh, for your modems uh, if you have a, a modem charger for your laptops or for any uh, cell phones and this can also run tv or electric fan now since we are in the philippines it's 60 hertz this one is 50 hertz so be careful when using this one if you're in the Philippines because this one is 50 hertz. TV, lights, charger, no issues because those are 50 and 60 hertz. But electric fans, uh, it's a it's a, it's a question. So before before buying this, make sure that the unit that you're going to be powered by this inverter is capable of 50 hertz okay so the build is really solid the whole casing is i think aluminum or die cast now only this one is plastic but what see plastic i think this one is die cast or aluminum and checking on the model so it has input voltage of 10 volts to 15.5 output and as i've said frequency is 50 hertz as you can see 300 watts max search it's 2x 600 at 25 celsius and the rest are there now this one is very unique 
because as you can see it in here these are your let's see okay these are your dip switch which you can control your lvd and at the same time uh you can also configure this configuring the uh, lvd and hvd and this needs a special application and the one that they put in this scotch tape is uh, it's just a pin for you to be able to turn this on but you can do a simple relay or switch that you can do a that you can remotely configure this this what makes this inverter very powerful and it's ac connectivity output small as you can see but very heavy this one will indicate this this is the indicator that this one is being remotely controlled uh, if you're going to use this use this properly what I did on my uh, previous or current setup is this one is only used for backup it's a pure backup since uh, we have a stable grid but from time to time uh, brownouts or blackouts cannot be uh, avoided so sometimes if there's a maintenance especially on Lenten season I'm using this just to power off my lights all the light loads but it's been running for five years no moving parts fans whatsoever so that this one make this uh, this makes a great advantage when it comes to remote areas where you don't need any moving parts and this has a remote meter also and at the same time this one has a special type of RS232 cable from Morningstar where you can extract its data so you can also put a uh, pin on this and it, it will show you the, the graph or its status and everything this is also where you place if you're going to upgrade anything or you're going to uh, change its LVD and HVD so comes with a simple manual so I hope it helps and if you have any questions